Yo guys, welcome back to another video, and today's uh, video I'm actually going to be showing you a island uh, mesh glitch that's actually currently working right now. Um, basically, this is just like a mega mesh on the island with no kill barrier at all. Um, for this, you will actually need sleeping bags uh, because what you are going to be doing is actually build going through the mesh by sleeping bags like that. Um, as you can see, it's the location of the map, and there is the coordinates right there. Now, what you are going to want to look for, uh, first of all, is actually that ledge, as you can see right here. And then just get your sleeping bag out and then move away from the ledge, where I am, and then just put a sleeping bag down. Um, it doesn't really matter where you place it. And also, it won't go any further than this the first time you do it, you, you, even if you like try going in third person or anything like that. Um, you won't be able to get it out any further. Uh, so for this, the minimum amount of sleeping bags you are going to need is actually three sleeping bags. Um, but it might take a couple of attempts to actually try and get into, so you're obviously going to need more. Um, so first of all, what you are going to do is place two sleeping bags like this, and then fast travel to the second sleeping bag. And um, if you've actually done it correctly, you should, you should be like kinder in the mesh, but not fully in the mesh. And um, the way to check this is just put another sleeping bag down. If a sleeping bag does go far away in front of you, you know you've done this right, and you can actually um, get into the mesh properly. But if it just does how I did here, um, then it's not really going to work, as you can see. Uh, so what you are just going to want to do is um, just keep doing it and over and over but slightly move the sleeping bag um, a little bit and uh, try and get into a better place. Just try and get that sleeping bag as far uh, far out as possible as you can see right here. Um, so this is the, the attempt I actually do get it. Um, so if you do actually place it in the same spot as me you will get it. Um, but as you can see once you do fast travel to this second sleeping bag what you are going to do is actually go around and pick your stuff up. As you can see I'm not in uh, creative mode so there's no kill barriers so far. Um, but what I am actually going to go and do is actually go and jump into creative mode to get some sleeping bags. And then um, I'll actually jump straight back out of it, show that there's no kill barriers here and etc. Like that. Uh, and there's also no uh, teleportation zones in this area as well. Um, this has actually been out for quite a while as, as well. Um, but as you can see right now, you can actually place the sleeping bag, if you do it correctly, far out into the mesh. And um, once you've managed to place this down, um, that's it, you're basically in the mesh really. So all you can have to do is just teleport to that sleeping bag. And then like I say, you will be in the mesh from there. And uh, as you can see, when I do actually teleport through the actual mesh of the mountain, there's no um, kill barriers or anything like that, as you can see right there. Um, so that's that. Uh, and then once you actually are in here, I'm just going to quickly jump into creative mode again to actually get some foundations and stuff to show you that you can actually build in here. Um, obviously, you can get your stuff as well once you're inside the mesh. Um, uh, and that's it really. As you'll see in the gameplay in a minute, you can actually build on this area. It's a massive, like areas to build in as you can see right here um so if you are looking for base spot uh, like base spots like i say yeah uh, and if you are one of the people that does post videos of um, raiding mesh bases this is always a good place to check um because he's more than likely going to be basing here because the size of, of well, the size of it as you can see right here and it just goes on for quite a while as you can see you can have massive bases and just everything in here really it's pretty crazy and um, insane and uh, but yeah and as you can see, if you do go through here, there's another little bit, as you can see, with a water pond there. Uh, now, I tried this with a sleeping bag, so you can't actually get inside of that with the sleeping bags. But obviously, if you did have a teleporter in here, mesh the teleporter. Um, and then you'll be able to go into that area and build in the water and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I hope this does help you all out. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And also drop a comment down below if this um, did help you out. And also drop a comment down below as well if you do need any help for any parts of the video. And um, yeah, we are actually on the road to two, uh, not just two, we are on the road to 3k, so if you can actually um, subscribe, if you're not already subscribed, I would appreciate that a lot. And um, also, if you do subscribe, turn the post notifications on so you also don't miss out on any future um, game-breaking glitches like this. The main purpose of me actually posting the mesh method methods that do actually work on official as well is to get them patched. Um, but I do post the odd occasion where it's not obviously working for official and uh, stuff like that, as you can see now. Um, but yeah, well thank you for watching, like I say, don't forget to like and subscribe, and also leave a comment down below if you are struggling, struggling. and to get out of this mesh method, all you are going to want to do is just walk through the wall and you'll be able to get out straight away. Um, but like I say, thank you for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe.